Any update on Cam Eccles there? Uh, he wasn't here today. He's got still has some symptoms, um, so I don't really have a good update on that. Unfortunately, I'd like to see him. I, you know, we all would. Uh, hopefully, he's here tomorrow. Okay. Uh, got a new quarterback in. Tell us about him. Yeah, well, we got a couple new players in. As you know, we're looking at him. Um, we know about PJ Walker. We've seen him play uh, other leagues. I know he's a good player. Um, we made a trade with Toronto a couple of weeks ago. Uh, wasn't sure exactly how it'd play out. Uh, he's here. He brought his uh, young daughter and his wife up. He wants to see what the CFL is all about. We'll get him up to speed. But um, no, it's more about to me. I mean, yeah, we got a couple new players, but we're looking for the other guys to step up. So was he on their neg list in Toronto? Or yeah, he was. And we just made a trade a couple weeks ago, hoping that we could entice him here, and uh, we were able to do that. What, what do you like about him specifically? Yeah, I mean, uh, it's, I do think he's a good player. He can move, he can throw, he's confident, he's had success. Um, it's like a lot of guys, though, he's looking, probably looking for a home. You know, like uh, when you play, I think he's been playing seven years uh, professionally. You know, you just kind of want to find a spot that you can fit in at. So it's still, you know, uh, five of us quarterbacks here. He's just a, a guy that, for me, I needed to look at, and I'm glad he's at least given us that opportunity. And uh, we'll see where it goes from there. Is it possible he hits the field this year? I mean, I, yeah, I think there's a possibility, but I also don't, you know, I just want him to, for all of us, just get to know each other, see what he's about. And, uh, you know, like I say, we want to put the best team on the field to win. That's that's the goal. Dave, you know who your starter is going to be? Yeah, I mean, definitely uh, feel like I gave Matt more reps today. Um, you know, I do think uh, he had a good uh, – series and a half basically in, in BC. Uh, I do certainly uh, feel like we, we have options, but yeah, I'm definitely um, looking to give Matt uh, more reps this week and see where it goes from there. Is this a good opportunity for you to see some, some new guys in the lineup kind of thing? Uh, somewhat, Glenn, but I, I just want to put the best team in the field and uh, I don't really want to just say, hey, you're playing because you haven't played. I think certain guys have been practicing hard and then, you know, if they showed in the game or if they're looking like they're doing a great job in practice and we need to see them fine. But, you know, if guys are working hard and they've been playing all year and they're still playing well, they're going to play. So not going to uh, – well, first off, we don't really have a huge roster anyway and there's salary cap implications. But well, we're going to put the best team we got uh, that we feel we can win on the field and, and hopefully win our last game at home. Dave, how disappointing is it that you guys aren't going to be going to the playoffs? The yeah, everyone's long, down. Long it was a tough one, but um, it's been a tough year anyway, so it's not like – you know, we had a lot of good moments. Um, team won't quit, though. Uh, we'll play hard and play in Edmonton, who's also out. Uh, guys that are professional and, and uh, have pride and, you know, they're, they yeah, they put the horse on the front, but they got their name on the back as well. They're going to give you everything they got. And it does say a lot about the players. I guess if you're really looking for future, you see how guys play in games that don't necessarily uh, have meaning for playoffs. Um, usually you can tell who really loves the game and who's a professional. How, how maybe how deflating was those last those five minutes of that fourth quarter? You guys played so well. In BC, yeah. It's been uh, yeah. It does seem like we find you know ways to, to lose games instead of necessarily winning, and it was deflating, Todd. No doubt about it. Um, you know, tried to keep our spirits up, but you know we were playing hard. You know what I do like though is that the defense. You know, we, we kept playing right till the end. Our offense, we kept playing right till the end, and. Uh, even though very frustrated and, and you could feel the air was out of the balloon after those couple of plays, kept playing, uh, kept working. It's just hopefully we can turn a corner and win a, and win a ball game.